Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to yet another installation of Zyori Vlogs. Today, we don't have much groundbreaking news. Again, seeming to be the recurring theme here around the Zyori Vlogs. do want to give you guys an update, though, mostly because I've actually been getting questions from people on Facebook and Twitter. Where you been? People on the Dota side of things and the Han side of things. Um, what have you been up to? And I assure you, as I assured you in the last vlog, uh, we are still working on quite a bit of stuff behind the scenes. Most notably, the website. We are totally redoing the website, reprogramming, I don't want to say from scratch, but redoing large portions of it, revitalizing some of the code, and completely reworking the GUI, the graphical user interface. Of course, Krazi has been... Um, well, I guess sort of redesigning from scratch, so to speak. Uh, but we're actually kind of nearing completion. We're in pretty good shape uh, on that front. We're looking to launch the website reasonably soon. Um, and of course, it's one of those things where all the work that goes into it isn't shown until the website is released. So uh, that's where most of my hours have been going in the world of Zyori TV recently, the programming. And uh, going through my old code and recognizing how ridiculously terrible it is, um, that's really been the most painstakingly slow slow process uh, is revitalizing all of that old code that is just clunky and out of the way and well just not what it needs to be so the website will be uh, significantly better change forever um, uh, um, depending the release which again, we don't have an exact date or our, our sort of time frame is early October um, Along with that, we're actually going to have a new studio location. This background here, Vindicator, Jim Morrison, they're actually going to be disappearing. I'm actually changing locations, and there will be plenty of pictures I show you. We're doing some painting and some, eh, not remodeling, but moving furniture, and um, we're going to have a new spot set up, a flat backdrop. Plenty of pictures will come, I assure you. They'll be all over Facebook uh, once we start moving stuff around, but that is very exciting. The timing is going to line up very nicely for uh, kind of the change in website and also change in uh, recording location. Uh, we do also have some special content for you guys. We have a special that I kind of hinted at in the last vlog uh, that we actually shot the footage for and we're doing the post-production now. It's going to be a YouTube-only release, uh, and it is an interview-based show. Uh, it is just a one-time thing. It's just a special, if you will. And I'm not going to say too much about it or who the guests are. I will say I have interviewed one of the primary uh, guests in the past. So that'll make you scratch your head a little bit. Uh, it was quite some time ago, but uh, very interesting. I was actually very happy with how the raw interview went, and I'm really excited to see what happens uh, in post-production. And that'll be sort of the trifecta. We're going to release all three things sort of um, all together in one fell swoop. Other than that, uh, September, of course, has been a very slow month, at least in the broadcasting department. We've been doing a lot of uh, administrative stuff, so to speak, as far as getting Crossy more uh, adequated with the, the way we do things here at Zyori TV and, of course, all the stuff that I've just been talking about that's been going on behind the scenes, uh, especially now that I'm going to be moving around and such. October, though, is shaping up to be quite busy. Totes got some... Some stuff on the schedule. I think we're going to be casting at least like two nights a week, or no, every weekend in October. I think we have something every weekend in October plus some additional stuff during the week. So uh, we're going to go back to a much more regular schedule, and there is a combination of things. It's Gosu's, uh, it's Gosu stuff will be returning. I don't think that schedule has been officially released yet, uh, but their stuff is going to be returning in October. So that is good news for me. I'm excited to get, get back to casting Dota 2, and it makes sense. You know, after September, or uh, after the international September was a little bit slow, a lot of teams in flux uh, a lot of big leagues still underway so um well they just took a month off so to speak but they will be back in full swing here in the month of october now the last thing that i do want to point out is i will be going to dreamhack winner it is official i bought my plane tickets today unfortunately not going to be casting at least nothing is set in stone yet i'm not going to be casting heroes of new earth uh, s2 already has their casters set up that's cool that's great happy for them on the dota 2 front who knows i imagine toby has all sorts of people lined up but i will officially be going the airfare has been booked my credit card has been charged, and we're in great shape. So I am just pumped. I'm going to be going for two weeks. I'm going to make a little vacation out of it. I'm going to be bunking up with Dawes and uh, mooching off of Admiral Bolgren's hospitality. Probably spend a little bit of time in Bolness as well. But um, if you are in Sweden around that time, well... I'll be in Sweden around that time. We'll see. Uh, we're still trying to formulate uh, the exact schedule for what we're going to be doing. It's two months off, so still plenty of time to talk about DreamHack Winter. Still formulating exactly where we're going to go, what we're going to do. Hopefully, we can do some cool promotional stuff. I'd love to hit some of the big land centers in Stockholm, Inferno, and a couple of the other ones. It would be awesome. But regardless, I will be there, and I'm pumped to see 
each and every one of you. So like I said, really not a lot in the vlog today. I think uh, we're, we're doing sort of an every other week type vlog style, and right now it's really hard because we have so much stuff going on that I can't really talk about in grave detail. It's a lot easier after we release something than I can go back and talk about why we did the things the way we did and all that kind of stuff. But now it's sort of just generic hype, so I do apologize for that. But um, rest assured that, what, what is it, it's always most quiet before the storm. There's probably some great cliche that I'm butchering there. Um, but yeah, that's about it. So regardless, guys, make sure you follow at all the social media at Zayori TV on Facebook and Twitter at Zayori TV one on YouTube for all of the latest updates. I do also want to say, um, if you guys have any ideas for decorations, like our Vindicator, our Jim Morrison, be more than happy to consider some, some cool pieces of art to put into the new studio environment. So, um, Pretty much anything nerd culture related that you can think of, feel free to email me. Just send it to me on any of the social medias uh, aforementioned. Go for it. Uh, I have bought a couple of things. We are. I think we're going to recycle Vindicator. He's he's run his course. Ever since they changed Vindicator, I've sort of felt a little bit like, eh, this poster isn't really representing what it represented when I bought it. Just saying. Just saying. So I did. I'm not going to spoil what I bought, but it's really fucking cool. Uh, I'm going to say that it is a. A piece of art made by someone in their living room, probably. It's not official Han or Dota art, but it's um, it's pretty slick. I, I was pretty happy with it. I dropped 35 bucks on it the second I saw it. So hopefully it comes, well, hopefully it just comes in general and it's not destroyed when it gets here because it looks a little bit fragile. Regardless, though, I'm open to suggestions. Anything you guys may think would look cool in the background at the ZTV headquarter i was trying to do that real slick but i failed anyhow guys thanks a lot we'll see you on another vlog about two weeks from now stay tuned though plenty of casting coming your way on the zaori tv channel